what we have here. Gloves. But that doesn't mean anything. It was an entirely different thing, right? Well, it's all for the gold. Record is not padded. I can knock you out, too. Well, if Cotto has a statement punch, it is that left hook to the body. He sledgehammered on Abdullayev with it. Torres seems to be looking to throw. Left hook puts him down after a perfect counter straight. Miguel Cotto, who answered a right hand. Crowd is noisy. The corner's going to have a. Oh, oh, and. Torres hurts Cotto with a left hook there. Miguel Cotto electing to trade punches. At this point on, he's as much at home as Cotto is. Cotto going back. And that's what I think Torres has. You remember that Chop Chop Crowley hurt Cotto with a right hand. He rocked the opponent in round one. Now Cotto takes Torres to the ropes, trades with him again, and for a big upset. Cotto trying to fight back. Going into a crouching position, but now he gets caught flush with a right game with him. You play hit and defense. Cotto is wobbly, and the ropes hold him up for the moment. He almost went to the canvas on that. Together with a minute and a half to go in the round. He gets ripped again, and down goes Miguel Cotto. But from those blows. Big left hook by Torres. This is going to raise a lot of questions about Miguel Cotto who was wobbled three times. Cotto has come back with two stiff punches. He's got to make certain he's delivered with his shots and keep his defenses in position. It's Foreman Lyle out of the guy steps in as a replacement. You take him for granted. He's got the pop. By hard shots from Torres in both rounds one and two, they've traded knockdown, but he's still getting hit with a lot of what Torres throws. Trading left hooks at close range, and Cotto isn't now. Such a big round. But take another rest. <laughs> oh, but the body shots. Man. Body shots by Cotto back. Quick, crisp left hook inside by Cotto. Torres comes back with the right and the left. Cotto driving him into the ropes. That hurt. He's going right back to it. Well, we saw that already that Cotto has a second gear. We have. There's the left hook to the body, which is going to make this Miguel Cotto's fight. It. But in the third round, I actually thought that Ricardo Torres faked it twice. He wanted to see... It only makes sense if you don't have a lot of dignity. Hard right hand to the body. Cotto's body punches. That arm, left arm pit. Yeah, you take away the fire, which gave him so much trouble in round two. Cotto was starting to relax a little bit, and that's when the trouble started. Left hook to the body, landing with considerable frequency, and that's... When you found a good meat, you go right back to that grocery counter, and that's There's what he's the doing. left hook to the body again, setting up a big left hook upstairs. And the scorecards, as Harold Letterman in the first round, as Harold Letterman pointed out... Because he caught him by surprise. Well, you the can't classic say no. case in recent years, of course, was Lennox Lewis Patali putting his imprint on the fight with that brutal left hook to the body. Torres. Oh, Cotto badly hurt with a right hand that busted him straight on the top. You got to realize I can't get hit. You're going to stand in front of him. Oh, Torres you're... busts in the second round. If Cotto doesn't. It's fault when you get a guy staggering, go as far away from him as you can and recover yourself. Make him walk to you. Tremendous round for Ricardo Torres, who once again hammered Miguel Cotto. Harold Edelman scorecard with Cotto one point ahead through the fifth round. Some scorecards score these guys. When they go to the corner, you don't want to hear a lot of information. Just get Cotto back awake around. Make that minute rest. Is this the kind of fight in which a trainer should be careful about trying to make tactics? Cotto be boxing. Well, Cotto is doing his best because he's, at the same point, he's recovering from shots too. The least active of the six rounds so far, largely because, as Larry Merchant pointed out, it appears Ricardo Torres is Torres can take Cotto's best shot. Cotto staggers when he hits. Oh. Be critical. What we have here, folks. He made the, the, the point, critical point. Me went to the canvas, two point round for Cotto. In more out of 61, a little bit more of a working margin. Can't go because the action is fast and furious as they trade punches close range here while they catch a breather. Okay. Harold, how do you have it so far? 56-53, four rounds to two, Miguel Cotto. 
since the early exchange in this. Goto catching Torres on the end of a punch again, and down goes Ricardo Torres. Down. And referee David Fields is going to stop it. Miguel Cotto survives. Big game.